It is one of the biggest scholarships program, especially from the US. It runs with over 150 countries, and it's bilateral, so it's always the US and a different country. Um, in the US itself, it's, it's the main uh, uh, grant scholarship that there is available. And uh, it's not only for academic achievement, uh, but it's also uh, to promote mutual understanding, so to get people to know each other. This weekend um, is our mid-year evaluation. We've all been here about five months now. And um, it's, I think basically to make sure that we're on track, that we're spending the government's money um, correctly. So uh, I think most of us are a pretty self-motivated group, but we need to report to our superiors saying what we've been doing with our time. Um, it's also, I think, nice just to reconnect with the other people who have Fulbrights in the Netherlands. It's a, a grant program which was set up after the Second World War by a senator called Fulbright um, who was so horrified by what happened during the Second World War that he uh, got some money together from selling old parts of uh, war machinery um, to make sure that something like the Second World War wouldn't happen again. So that money was used to promote mutual understanding and that's still the goal of the whole Fulbright program. Um, it is to promote mutual understanding and to make sure that people know each other's cultures so that something as devastating as the Second World War couldn't happen again. The Fulbright Scholarship for me um, has really been able to it's given me the opportunity to advance my goals. Um, it's allowed me to come to a new country, a new university, a new community to um, kind of figure out my role in development and how um, best to continue. It also, since it's quite a prestigious award, has opened a lot of doors for me um, professionally, especially for the future and with other graduate schools and other research opportunities, being able to have this under my belt just really um, creates connections and opportunities that weren't there before.